guys, it's Caitlin, and welcome back to my crafting channel. And today, we are going to make oobleck. If you don't know what this is, it's a solid and a liquid, so it's science, but, um, so, this is just really interesting. I think Dr. Seuss made it up or something, and they actually made it. And I think this also can clean tabletops. I'm not sure that's what my science teacher said, so I'm just going to go with that. The materials you will need are a bowl, any size that you want, um, any kind of bowl, it depends how much oobleck do you want, a spoon, any size spoon, it doesn't matter, I'm just going to use a like medicine spoon, cornstarch, baking soda, and a half measuring cup. Or if you don't have a half measuring cup, and I think everybody does, but if you don't, then I would just use a spoon to measure it, because it really matters how much you want. You can use any kind of measuring cup. Depends how much oobleck you want. Okay, so we are going to start out with the cornstarch. Oh, and water. You need water. Sorry. Um... So you will just take one half cup of cornstarch to start it off. And I don't think, you probably don't want to eat this, it's not food. Um, so yeah, just to give you a heads up, if you didn't know that. And exactly half a cup. Once you have a half cup, it's okay if it's a little more, it's, um, the oobleck isn't exact. Um, you're just going to dump it inside the bowl, and you probably want a bigger bowl than I have, but oh well. So next, we are going to take our baking soda and open it. And we are going to go ahead and take two cups of this. And I'm getting a bigger bowl because I don't know how much this will take up. But it depends how much oobleck you want. But I think we'll need about this much. And so we're going to take two halves of baking soda. And it doesn't have to be exact. baking soda, or two parts. So the last thing we'll need is one cup of water. So I'm just going to dump the water in there. Then this is where you need the spoon and you will need to stir it up. And it will make oobleck. You just kind of get need to get it everywhere. If it's too watery, you might need to add a little more baking soda or, or um, cornstarch, but it should be about, see it's solid but a little, and yeah, it's okay if you get this on your table because it does clean it, so I just, just mixed it up. And that's the oobleck. It's a solid and a liquid, so you can pour it in your hands, but it's a solid. It's really cool. Um, if you put it on your hands, I think it, for um, my friends and I, it does get off dry skin. So it is, it does, like, help and everything. And it is messy, so you can just clean it up with water. It's not a big deal, um, but if you can see... It is a solid when I touch it, but it flows like a liquid, so that's the science about it. Um, so thank you so much for watching. Give it a big thumbs up, and subscribe to my crafting channel for more. Um, so yeah.
and that's how you make the oobleck and it's really messy but it does help your table and stuff and clean <laughs> and it's not that hard to pick up but um thanks bye